case briefs and so much more ls data's got what you're looking for in 2000 the case of apprendi vs new jersey brought into sharp focus the fundamental principles of the american criminal justice system and the vital role of the jury at the center of this complex legal challenge was Charles C. Apprendi Jr., who challenged the constitutionality of a law that led to his sentence being enhanced for committing a hate crime. Apprendi had been charged with unlawfully possessing a weapon and using it to intimidate victims based on their race, sending shockwaves through a previously all-white neighborhood when he fired bullets into the home of an African-American family. Despite his admission to the crime and statements that expressed racial bias, the charges brought against him never mentioned the hate crime statute or alleged racial bias. Condemned to serve 12 years in prison, Apprendi appealed the hate crime enhancement added to his sentence. His argument rested on the insistence that the bias underpinning his hate crime sentence should have been proved beyond a reasonable doubt to a jury. The judicial journey of the case ended at the Supreme Court, which found itself grappling with the question of whether a hate crime sentence enhancement contravenes the Due Process Clause of the 14th Amendment. The court affirmatively declared that a biased intention to intimidate was not only a relevant aspect of the crime, but was indeed crucial to understanding the offense regardless of its reflection or lack thereof in the criminal code. In a major departure from the status quo, the court concluded that the New Jersey procedure being contested by Apprendi flouted the essential tradition of the jury system. In a bold reaffirmation of the vital role of juries in maintaining civil and political liberties, the Supreme Court reversed the judgment of the New Jersey Supreme Court, sending the case back down for further proceedings. This landmark decision underscored the principle that any fact that escalates a crime's penalty beyond the pre-designated statutory maximum must face the scrutiny of a jury and be proven beyond any reasonable doubt. The tale of Apprendi v. New Jersey serves as a compelling reminder of the constitutional checks and balances that govern the American criminal justice system. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Visit LSE.law. Elevate your mind. Leave the stress of class.